Welcome back to another My Two Good Hands video. We are in the basement. We are working on a floor. You can see in front of me here, I've got laminate flooring. Let's talk a little bit about it. I'll show you up close and then we'll get started. So this is our laminate flooring. Some of the things you can see, we've got the thickness of it, 4.2 millimeter. It tells you it's stone powder core. It's got a uh, 12 millimeter construction grade uh, layer and it's got 0.3 of uh, millimeter on the wear and it's got one millimeter on the underlayment uh, kind of gives you the plank size how much is per box how many pieces per box there's 12 in each box they're very heavy it's probably about 30 40 pound of per box uh, you can see we put some out there on the floor uh, normally you'd strike a line through the middle of the room work your way out what we're going to do is we're going to start in this corner because we kind of measured in the room's real square plus when we get to the far side and uh, end of the wall, we're a little crooked. It doesn't really matter because that edge is where we store a whole bunch of stuff. Anyhow, there's shelves and stuff going there. We have to do some cutting here. Uh, one of the keys when you do this is to stagger the joints like this. We'll show you what we've set up so we can work on staggering joints and how we're going to cut these. So uh, what we're going to do is probably take four or five pieces and do the staggering and then uh, pick it up from there. But, uh, let's get going. We'll show you what we do to cut these. So to cut the flooring, we did set up the chop saw. We hooked up the shop vac. You can see we did the same thing here where we got the hole in the pin like we do on our bandsaw. So we're going to start cutting these off. So let's get started on that. saw big enough, that's going to be your problem. We're going to start a bucket a little part. Now what we're going to do, what we're going to do is we're going to go get more of these. I'm going to cut them at a few different lengths to stagger the joints. Uh, so that'll be how that works. We'll make sure that this is clean before you bring it over to your work area. I'm we'll kind of cut these at random. Clean. Remember, these are the far side. So what we're gonna do with the far side is lay them over by the wall. Just, gotta remember, this is a piece that would go like this. So we cut it enough, so now we got three runs coming across. Uh, the next one, we'll have to see where we're at on the wall. Maybe we'll cut it, maybe we won't. But uh, we're going to take you over there and show you how it goes down. So you can see how we've started this here. Now it's a matter of taking these, picking them up, and latching them in. So this one here has to latch under here, and it has to be like that. And then you can take your next piece, make sure it's clean underneath, and uh, has to latch under here and slide up to here. Then you got to latch it into here. You want to make sure you're latched as best you can get. It's hard on the first row because the problem you have to get is you have to get every one of these tight. And uh, you can see how that's a little crooked there. So take this one up, move this one up a little bit and out. 
make sure that you want to make sure you're latched uh, correctly. It's difficult when you start out. Once you get going, it's pretty easy. But uh, here we go. Now it's nice and good. We can come with the next one. And here, same sort of deal. Put that up there. You can see how it wants to lift that one. That's why I want to kind of work uh, one row at a time as I go. Uh, you can see that's kind of, that's good. It's down. Okay. Oh, we got another one we'll put down there. This one is the last one that can go on this run. Before we have to do some cutting here. That's good. Now we're just going to keep continuing down like that, all the way down to the corner over there. And uh, that's open, so we'll be just kind of ending. And then we're going to be working our way back and forth like this. We'll bring you back when we got a lot more done. Well, there you go. You can see how the floor is progressing. Uh, the whole room looks pretty nice now. So don't forget to like and subscribe. Use the Amazon links below to shop. Well, you can go to your local hardware store and get that this or go to Menards or go into any of those places. If you shop on Amazon for anything, use the links below. It does help support this channel. So we appreciate your uh, support. You can get a good deal on these on Amazon, and I will put a link below.